हेलो स्टूडेंट्स माय नेम इज प्रोफेसर मोहम्मद आसिम एंड वी आर डूइंग एड मैथ एड मैथ फॉर आई जी सी एस ई स्टूडेंट्स विच हैव सिलेबस कोड 0606 एंड फॉर सी आई ई ओ लेवल स्टूडेंट्स विच हैव सिलेबस कोड 4037 सो बोथ काइंड ऑफ स्टूडेंट्स कैन गेट इक्वल बेनिफिट फ्रॉम दिस कोर्स स्टूडेंट्स इन लास्ट लेक्चर वी फिनिश्ड एक्सरसाइज फिफ्टीन एंड द टॉपिक वॉज एरिया अंडर द कर्व Today we are going to start exercise 15.11 and the topic you can see on your screen area of regions bounded by a line and a curve the formula of this area between the two regions is i am reading these two lines and the formula if two functions fx and gx intersect at x is equals to a and x is equals to b then the area a enclosed between the two curves is given by a is equals to limit a to b fx dx minus limit a to b gx dx so in the light of this formula i am going to start question number 1 exercise 15.11 but before i start question number 1 i would suggest all those students who are watching my lecture first time kindly go to my playlist there is a folder name is admath watch previous lectures of exercise 15.10 after watching definitely you will have good command on this topic and you will be able to do questions of exercise 15.11 question number 1 find the area of the region enclosed by the curve y is equals to 1 plus cos x y is equals to one plus cos x and y is equals to 1 students in this question limit is not given limit of x so this point from this point to this point we need these two coordinates of x how very easy just compare these two equations drop y so 1 plus cos x is equals to 1 this one cancel by this one cos x is equals to 0 x is equals to cos inverse 0 cos inverse 0 if you use your scientific calculator cos inverse 0 occur at pi by 2 negative and pi by 2 positive you can check if you find cos Minus pi by two, and if you find cos pi by two, you will get zero. So I am writing the limit over here from minus pi by two to plus pi by two. Now it's a time to find the area. What is the formula of the area? A is equals to integrate limit is minus pi by two. To plus pi by two, f x dx. The curve is one plus cos x minus limit. Sorry, minus pi by two to plus pi by two, and the equation is one y is equals to one one dx because the formula is y dx. So y is one. So I have put y. I have put one. So area is equals to one. Sorry, I forgot to put dx. One dx is x. Limit from minus pi by two to pi by two plus cos dx. Cos integration is sine x. Limit from minus pi by two to plus pi by two. Minus one dx integration is x. 
limit is minus pi by 2 to pi by 2. If you see carefully, x minus pi by 2 to plus pi by 2 and minus x pi by 2 to plus pi by 2 is cancelled. So, no need to simplify. Sin x, sin pi by 2 minus sin minus pi by 2. Sin pi by 2 is 1 minus sin pi by 2 is minus 1. So, minus minus plus 1. 1 plus 1 is 2. Hence, the area bounded by the region y is equals to 1 plus cos x and y is equals to 1 is 2. Move to question number 2. Question number 2 is find the area of the region bonded by the curve y is equals to 2 plus 3x minus x square. The line x is equals to 2 and the line y is equals to 2. So actually we have to find this area. I mentioned with red pen this area. Now very easy question. The limit is given from 0 to 2 x limit x limit 0 to 2 and the equation is 2 plus 3x minus x square and this time I am going to find out the area of rectangle this one I assign this name is uh, a1 so if we subtract the integration answer and the area of rectangle which is 2 to the 4 we will get the area of the required region sorry I forgot to put dx which is very important because without operator how can we integrate so 2 to the 4 now integrate this 2 integration is 2x 3x integration is 3x square upon 2 x cube integration is x cube upon x square integration is x cube upon 3 so 2 limit from 0 to 2 plus 3 upon 2 limit from 0 to 2 minus 1 upon 3 x cube limit 0 to 2 and don't forget to subtract 4. Now apply the limit to on x 2 minus 0 plus 3 upon 2 x square. So 2 square is 4 and 0 square is 0. So just write 4 minus 0 minus 1 upon 3. 2 cube is 8 and 0 cube is 0. 2 to the 4 plus 2 to the 4 3 to the 6 minus 8 upon 3. 4 plus 6 is 10 minus 8 upon 3. 10 3 is a 30. 30 minus 8 is 22 upon 3. Sorry, I think there is some mistake. But I will check. Sorry, again I forgot to subtract 4, that is the area of rectangle. This is my mistake. Minus 4 cancel by plus 4. So 3, 6 are 18, 18 minus 8 is 10, 10 upon 3, 10 upon 3 can be right, 3 whole, 1 upon 3. So question was very easy, but I forgot two times to subtract 4, that is the area A1, area of rectangle.
area of rectangle formula is len into breadth. So, 2 to the 4. Now, move to question number 3. Question number 3 is find the area of the region bounded by the curve y is equals to 3x square plus 2, the line y is equals to 14 and the y axis. So this question is different with previous questions and exercise 15.10. What is the difference? In this diagram, we have to find the area between a curve and the y axis. So, for this we have to use the formula area A is equal to limit A to B x dy. This is the formula when we have to find the area between the curve and the y axis. Now, first we have to find this point because this is the limit. Upper limit is given but lower limit is not given. But you know at this point because this point is touches the uh, touches y axis therefore at this point x is equals to 0. So y is equals to 3 x 0 0 square plus 2 and y is equals to 3 0 the 0 plus 2. So this point is 2. Now the equation given y is equals to 3 x square plus 2 so we have to make x is the subject because the formula is x dy not y dx please keep in mind so y minus 2 is equals to 3 x square y minus 2 upon 3 is equals to x square y minus 2 upon 3 root is equals to x so, our question is limit from 2 to 14 x y minus 2 upon 3 whole root dy. I hope you completely understand. Now, we have to integrate. First, I am taking, taking out upon root 3 outside the rectangle. So, it will be 1 upon root 3. 2 to 14, y minus 2 to the power, root means 1 upon 2. Sorry, dy, not dx. Next, y minus 2 integration is y minus 2 to the power, 1, 1 upon 2 plus 1 is 3 upon 2 into upon 3 upon 2 becomes 2 upon 3. So, 2 upon 3 root 3 y minus 2 to the power 3 upon 2 and the limit is from 2 to 14. Okay. Now, apply limit. 2 upon 3 root 3 upper limit is 14 14 minus 2 is 12 so 12 power 3 upon 2 minus lower limit is 2 so 2 minus 2 is 0 and something multiply by 0 is always 0 so our answer is 2 upon 3 root 3 and this 12 can be right 2 square into 3 power 3 upon 2. 2 square is 4, 4, 3 is 12, 12 power 3 upon 2. So, no change. I am doing remaining work over here. So, 2 upon 3 root 3 multiply by 2 square to the power 3 upon 2 is 8 
into three power three upon two. So two upon three root three into eight. Three power three upon two can be write three root three, and this three root three and this three root three cancel. Eight to the sixteen is our final answer. So hope you enjoy this interesting and very important part according to examination point of view. Move to next question. Find the area of the shaded region. Very very easy question. If we find the area A is equals to the limit from zero to pi by two, two sine two x plus three cos x dx minus if we find the area of this right angle triangle so after finding the area if we subtract this we will get final answer that is the area of shaded region what is the formula of the area of triangle 1 upon 2 base is pi by 2 and height is 3 base is base is pi by 2 and height is 3 Now integrate 2 sin 2x integration is minus 2 cos 2x upon 2 plus 3 cos x integration is 3 sin x. 2 cancel by 2 minus 1 and minus 3 pi into 1 is 3 pi upon 2 to the 4. Here limit from 0 to pi by 2 plus 3 sin x 0 to pi by 2 minus 1 cos 2 into pi by 2 is cos pi and cos pi is minus 1 minus cos 2 into 0 is 0 and cos 0 is 1. plus 3 sin x means sin pi by 2 sin pi by 2 is 1 and sin 0 is 0 so only 1 so minus 1 minus minus plus 2 sorry minus 2 plus 3 minus minus plus 2 plus 3 is 5 minus this area of triangle 3 pi by 4 this is our final answer so this is another way if we have a rectangle or a triangle and you know finding the area of rectangle and the and finding the area of triangle is not difficult so we just find the area under the curve and subtract area of rectangle from that so student this is our today's class where we did first four questions of exercise 15.11 the next question will be the sketching of curve and lines and find the area enclosed between their graphs very easy not difficult but little bit lengthy but I will try to finish as soon as possible so student this is our today's class if you think that my videos are helping you kindly do subscribe my channel and whenever you subscribe don't forget to press the bell icon button so that when i upload my videos you will get the notification kindly share my videos as many as you can okay students good luck for next lecture